But this isn't what we're looking for now. We'll stop by later on some gloomier day. I mean, I thought it was already pretty gloomy, but as you can see, the clouds are beginning to roll away. I normally like gloomy weather, but it just goes to show, you know, if there were monsters that lurked around and were always ready to kill you as soon as it got gloomy, you wouldn't like gloomy weather too much anymore now, would you? No, you wouldn't. Oh, that must be from the past, you know, because she's not getting letters wherever she is now. I really think you guys should have considered investing in rebuilding this gate. I understand we don't have much money, but surely everyone could have pulled resources and we could at least put up a barrier? You saw all those shades. There's nothing at all stopping them from just waltzing downtown. Uh, everywhere, like every step, you just hear... Yeah, I'm kind of busy now. You just hear one desperate person after another. Or people who are almost accusatory, like, Yeah, Nier, I don't have time for you, I'm busy. I remember, Nier, when we gave you all that charity. You, you think we were going to forget about that? And now, now we don't have time for, for that, Nier. We don't have that kind of luxury. What's that box? Is it what I think it is? The missing cargo? I think this is one of the pieces of cargo that washed ashore. She asked me not to look. This will go down easier if I do what she wants. A wise choice. Rifling through the possessions of others is a vulgar habit. Hasn't stopped us before, but she specifically asked us not to, so, you know, we have to be we have to honor that. Or near the people are gonna stop hiring near. Hello. We can't go hunting, then we have to fish. Thank goodness for the sea. Humans often consider the, you know, think of oceans as like an infinite tub of food. But it's not. It's full of complex systems like the land, and if you take out too many fish, well, it can't bounce back. Well, I guess we're going to the scrap heap. The issue is... I don't know, should we take the... What the? Well, I mean, should we take the... What the? Oh! I was gonna say we should take the ferryman, except that it doesn't get us all that close to the scrap heap, but... Help! Help! Oh, gods, please help me! What is it? What's wrong? There's this huge shade near the bridge in the northern plains. It killed three members of my family, including my wife. Just cut her down right in front of me. And it attacked my daughter, too. Gods, it was horrible. You don't need to ask. I'm on it. It appears and disappears like the wind. You could go days in the northern plains without seeing it, and then all of a sudden... The second we see it, it's dead. Well, not the second, but you have the idea. I really do. Even in these desperate times, the whole village is behind me. If you're an extraordinary enough guy, what can I say? You get support from people. People admire that, especially when you, you know, save their town over and over. By the bridge, huh? You know, sometimes I think we're a little too ruthless with the shades. But then I think, well, you know, they're ruthless with us. No. Oh. You know, Shade, if you just were to... Well, who am I kidding? At this point, you're outside, you're gonna be killing Shade. That's all there is to it. In fact, let's try this beauty out for size. That circular attack is really what makes, uh... You know, is really what makes this sword worth it. The, the whole two-handed swords in general is what makes them worth it. Look at them just disintegrating. I bet that you their armor protects them from the sunlight. It could stand to do a better job though, couldn't it? Well, not really. It's just the issue is we're taking it off of them. You know, Nier, you're a pretty ethical guy in so many ways. He can I mean, remember how he considers all human life sacred? It's just remarkable. I mean, it's not really. A lot of people do. But I don't know. You ever been covered head to toe in blood? That can change a man. Or a woman, for that matter. Uh... 
any effects. I'm gonna go with Weaken. Even if it's just level one. Well. Boar, let's get going. I like how Kaine doesn't even bother asking, hey, can I ride the boar with you? She knows better than that. And she can keep up. She can run so fast and also teleport because she's magic. Well, there's a bridge. No sign of that giant shade I've heard so much about. Oh, there's some shades, though. That's the thing about them is they come out of nowhere. Wait, did I just do that? Just that, like, light tap from an awkward angle was enough to do that much to them, huh? Oh, you de done yet, Shade? Nope. But now it is. I've said it many times, and I'll say it again. Nobody kills Shades like Nier. Nope, no giant Shades. Just normal little Shades. Hey! I swear, you little ones, you really gotta do this! Well, they're all little, aren't they? Oh, now there's another one dead. Yeah, you know, there really was something almost heroic about the way that that last shade we fought struggled on so long. But, you know, after it killed Kaine, I kind of lost that sense. Then again, I don't know. I mean, we've killed a lot of shades, after all. Where's their big tragic scene, huh? Well, once again, I don't really know that they know how to, that they can think. So, eh, who cares? You see, if we got on that, on the lift, it would have only taken us, or on the boat, it would have only taken us to there. Not all that near the, oh, shades? Yeah, shades. Well, uh, how about, I know I should apply some magic words to our, uh, martial arts already. But I just haven't. So, Mr. Shade. Look at it running around like a chimp. You hurt Nier, you know? Let me tell you something about, about Nier. He doesn't like it when you hurt him. There are a few things he can't stand. One of them is Shade. Other things include cruelty, injustice. Unless it's to Shades. Any cruelty towards them is well-founded. Because it's earned. Now, you see, if those shades were just like, hey, you know, they got up, they wavered around a white flag, like, hey, near, we want to talk, I'd say, okay, fine. I'll stop for a second. The issue is, I don't know that Kaine would. Anyway, um, not that that would ever happen in a million years. Okay, what are we doing here? Oh, yeah, Scrappy. Oh, yeah, and Shades. How could I have forgotten? I'm being joking, of course. I, I, I don't forget about Shades. That's not the sort of thing you forget. Actually, Vice. There, no. Here's no. Here's here's what we'll do. Uh, for most for most of the time, I think that Dark Lance better than Dark Lance is Dark Execution. The issue with Dark Execution is it kind of takes a second. Hey! I don't appreciate it. This stupid stinking. Animals. You know, it's a nice touch that, um... Oh, wait, that's not what I wanted. It's just this one. Well, anyway. So, hold on. That's not the one I want. I don't want Dark Execution. I want that one I was using, Dark Phantasm. I'd say the name is less intimidating, but it really doesn't give you a clear idea of what it is. I mean, to think that the Lost Shrine was just that way. This goes to show, you never... It can't be hard to... Well, I never have a, much of a sense of direction anyway. I know people who can be like, Oh, well, this direction is north, and this direction is south. But me, I don't know any of those directions. I mean, I know I'm on a map. If you tell me, well, this way is east, for example, I can figure out what the other directions are. But just ha generally having a sense of which way is which? No, I, I never do. It's a miracle that the Shades have never torn this down. I mean, I'm glad they haven't. Those brothers would be totally cut off up here otherwise. Uh, 
Hey, we don't have time for this. Nier is a crazy man. And we all know it. Well, he's not crazy. Crazy is such an over and misused word. People call crazy, oh, this, you know, things are like slightly weird. They call insane people crazy. They call sometimes a good story crazy. And I'm as subject to this strange misuse of it as much as anyone else. But I try to be a little cognizant of these sorts of things. Does that make it worse that I would ever use the word? Perhaps. But I mean, there's some things I've never done that I think are just really annoying. I mean, I, I mean I'm sure that some people are going to be like, oh man, gee, what a dweeb saying this kind of stuff. But I, you know, I, I can say what I think. There's got to be tons of machinery here. Yeah, but I don't know how much we can actually use. Oh, wow! Check this out! It looks brand new! Hey, be careful there. I'm fine! Oh, no! Huh? The junk heap. Perhaps we should speak to the brothers. They might know something about this. When you lead a life like theirs, you know, certain things become inevitable. Like violent death. But... Wait a minute. Oh, you survived! Oh, hello again. You're the little one, aren't you? You've grown. Oh, wait a minute. That was something that happened years ago. How fares your brother? My brother. My brother's been dead for four years. I see. Please forgive the question. It's okay. Look, I need to ask you something. What is it? You heard any rumors about shades around here? Not the little guys. I'm looking for one that's unusually big and strong. No, I haven't heard about anything like that. But I haven't really been listening. I just... I just want to destroy robots. Rip them up. Uh, okay. Well, never mind then. Sorry to bug ya. Have anything else to say? Wait. Yes. I recently got my hands on a weapon. A very powerful weapon. I thought you might get some use out of it. Hmm. This sword has seen better days. Yeah, it's pretty beat up. I, I mean, there's potential, but it's fairly powerless right now. Can you repair it? I can repair anything with the proper material. If you'll fix it, I'll get the parts. Eehee! I'm so glad I decided not to throw this out. I'm gonna need some mem some memory alloy. Only the real big enemies on the second basement level have them, so watch yourself. And also, here's the passcode to get down there. Use it on the elevator. You got it. Hopefully we can find some better rare parts down there, too. So he's developed a hatred for robots like Nier has a hatred of shades, huh? What was that strange robot he let was, you know, he was staring at, though? You never saw anyone like that, and it didn't seem to be attacking him. 
In fact, it seemed to just be staring. Though I can imagine being angry at it for its inaction. I mean, it's the three laws of robotics right there. Although, as they explained in, uh... In Valhalla... Wait, hold on. This is the way we got out before, but can we go back down here through this room? I was kind of curious. Um... No. Anyway, as they explained in Valhalla, though those laws were originally made up by Asimov and have been kind of codified over the years, perhaps to a sort of infantilizing extent, Shame about the older lad. He was but a child. He died protecting the only family he had left. It's a damn shame. So you're going to fetch parts to fix a lighthouse? Yeah. There was this old lady that helped me once, and I'm fixing the lighthouse where she used to live. Exactly who did the helping is a matter of debate, but regardless. Wow! Lighthouse keeper! That sounds kind of romantic. Indeed. She was nothing if not a hopeless romantic. Yeah, I guess she was. There are a lot of odd memories attached to this place. Odd because you wouldn't think they'd become attached to this place, but it just goes to show how you never know how things are going to link together. Anyway, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, but you know, in the future, those laws ended up being changed because uh, because it was seen as detrimental to robots' civil rights, as they talked about in Valhalla. That sort of thing also happens in Astro Boy. Well, once again, we're not going to the second floor. We want to go to the basement, basement level two. I just get this feeling that the further you are from the entrance, the more dangerous the robots are. There's really no reason to expect that to be the case. It's just how things tend to go, you know? Further near goes towards something, the worse it gets. Well, in some way, I mean, for example, you know, it's cer we're certainly in many senses a lot worse off now than we were before when it comes to helping Yona. But for example, we at least now know who is to blame for all of this. And now we even know where he is, even if it took all these years. Plus, we still have Kaine. I mean, she's nearly died a few times now, so... You know, next time she nearly dies, it'll be fine, you know. Right, actually, not, not, not next time she nearly dies, but next time she dies, it'll be fine. Because it won't be like she's really gonna be dead. That's the kind of woman she is. Why do I get the feeling I'm going to eat these words? Anyway. Uh, I think that this is the passageway to the... to where I'm trying to get to. Oh, God. These robots don't even have good parts to mine. Another one of these, huh? The answer, by the way, is, is yes. These things are everywhere. But I have a feeling this is not the elevator room. No, it's not. It, you know, there's something a lot less lonely. At first, this was just near. Then, it was near in a book. Now, it's near in a meal in Kaine. Although, a few of those guys are not in here right now. You know, nobody's perfect. Okay, see, now they teleported in. They took a second because they were so busy fighting the robots in the other room. Kaine is one of those people, when she starts a fight, she doesn't want it to end until, you know, someone is dead. Probably not a human, though. I don't think she'd just go around murdering humans senselessly. Unless she were a shade, but she'd be doing that then, not because she's her, but because she's a shade. I can imagine feeling some guilt about that, but Kaine, it's important to remember, as I'm sure you do, that you are not the worst part of you. 
It's like those people are like, oh, you know, humans are animals because, like, people can have under certain extreme circumstances violent tendencies, even if they're normal people or whatever. Well, I mean, of course humans are animals, but you, you know what I mean. But then they say that, but that's silly, like, there's no reason to say that, oh, the worst aspect of you is, like, somehow realer than the best part. Like, yeah, you know, like, people might have some base motivation, but, like, like, I don't know, maybe somebody, like, you know, can under certain circumstances do terrible things. But, like, is the potential to do that really somehow more truly who they are than, say, I don't know, the fact that they like to write novels or poetry or something? That's a very bad formulation of my argument. I'll formulate it better some other time. Right now, we need to kill stuff. On the subject of that, I think that I've totally missed where I needed to go. Uh, well, that's fine. Just means a few extra robots dead. Although, I don't really care too much about that. Shades are the important ones. But still, you know, all that shade fighting has sort of prepped near in some level for this, too. Especially since shades definitely have something to do with this place and are probably, you know, in here somewhere. Um, yeah, this way. Yeah, I suppose Emil wasn't there for the lighthouse lady, was he? That's fine, of course. You know, we can't all be there for all the great moments. But her memory lives on. She really was a romantic, wasn't she? Oh, come on, guys. Let's go crack some metal skulls. Well, they even, I don't know they even have heads, most of these robot designs, so I shouldn't even call them skulls, but... Nobody understands the importance of family better than Nier. Or on quite the same extent as Nier, anyway. Vice, I know we've been shut in, Vice, okay? No need to even point it out, Vice. Hey, Kaine, Emil, you guys take care of the robots. I'll take care of the, um, turrets. Or, you know... Well, actually, yeah, that is what happened. More or less. There's still more of these things. It just goes to show that just because I expected them to be tougher on this level does not mean at all that they were going to be. Clearly they're not. Clearly it's more of the same down here. Not even worth wasting magic on most of these guys. Oh, no, get away, it's gonna blow up and it'll probably blow up the bomb. I mean, really it won't, but if this made some more internal sense, it totally would. I'm not sure what what happened with that magic spell. It felt like it wasn't really completed. Anyway, yeah, there have been cartographers down here too, huh? This is one big area. Where to even begin? Let's go that way. I have a good feeling. Great feeling. Guys, kind of move. Kinda, you almost got us all killed. Oh, that's fine. You know, you've gotten us not killed lots of times too, because you're a pretty good fighter. So, we'll go to this dead end first. Magic everywhere. In fact, all this combination of robotics and supposed magic makes me wonder if it isn't magic at all. But after all the weird stuff Nier has seen, I don't know. A lot of this, how could it be anything but magic? No more, huh? Well, you know, that's fine. 
It's not like these things are strong anyway. On the contrary. Any other takers? Huh? No? That's what I thought. Uh, anything valuable? Yeah, there's some stuff. Let's see. Hold on. Um, we do not have nearly enough of any of that stuff. Wait, what's this one? Oh, yes, there's that. Well, that is rather urgent, but we're gonna go to the Forest of Myth after this anyway, so we'll deal with it then. It'll only take us, like, another day, right? Oh! Here we go. You know, we're in here, we'll get the parts for the lighthouse, get the parts for the guy's kitchen. We'll get the parts for, for, the, for the sword. We'll get the parts for everything, I'm sure. What good did that do us? Not much. Well, Nier always has been good at destroying things, even when he's not entirely sure why he should be. This is just keeping up the trend. You know, it sure would be nice if Kaine and Emil were also carrying some uh, herbal, you know, healing herbs and other remedies. That'd be great. That'd be so helpful if they also could contribute to our Poultice collection. But of course they're not going to. Darn. I see that the cartographer didn't go through there anyway. Is this, yeah, this is another dead end. Any takers? Any, anybody want to, yeah, yeah. Oh, these are like those ones that Nier fought before when he was on the minecart all those years ago. Yeah, they're just like those ones, except they're the same, actually, so there's no except. How did that not hit them? You saw, like, it literally, clearly made contact with them. Well, whatever. It's nothing that Nier can't take out with his magic powers, persistence, vast magic powers again. Hey, Kaine, could you... Okay, they took out the... Well, Emil got it, actually, not Kaine. That's fine. It doesn't really matter. The point is that the end result's the same. Well, it's certainly not always true that the ends justify the means, but in this case, it's fine. Nice try, robot. Not really, it was pretty pitiful. What now? Well, of course, I know it's now. Robots! Robots, robots, robots. Robots, robots, all of the robots, every robot, all the time, robots. Is this really the most advanced robots they built? They s I still think these things seem pretty crude. And moreover, they're clearly not designed to attack at a distance, either. You'd think they would have been building these things to, um, you know, be ranged? Once again, why didn't that work? Well, whatever, this will work. More or less. Kaine, move! She just doesn't care if she's about to get blown up. She just is so bold, so... Well, you know, reckless, but whatever. Okay, now what? Um, no, oh, keep going deeper. Of course. I guess this place really has always been huge, but Nier just isn't going to get the access codes to anywhere near all the stories. I suppose it makes sense that for the purposes of protecting their business that those brothers wouldn't have wanted to just give them out freely. Yeah, we're gonna need a bomb. Probably gonna be one in here, though. We seem to have been shut in. Well, yeah, but... Or some robots. Just don't... Oh, well, there's one robot less now. 
Yeah, I don't think those are the kind of holes you want to fall into. At least that's my best guess. Amber? Why is there an occlusion of amber down here? Wait a minute, what the? Not sure what that's here for. Thought maybe we could put it in the hole? Cause pressure to build up and cause an explosion and will kill everybody for some reason? Oh! Well... And that was the end of the story. It would have been a fittingly tragic ending. A realistically tragic ending. Nier slipped and fell into a hole after defeating hundreds and hundreds of shades. It's like how Patton survived all of World War II, then died a little bit after the war in a car accident. That's life for you. Really, we don't want them to fall into these pits, because if they do, we can't, you know, get resources from them. Hey, you know, it's all this industry going on here, but most of it's still stored in, uh... You know, most of their supplies are stored in... Well... Wooden crates. I mean, not all of it, clearly. But some of their supplies, I mean, it's like, amber? What does a factory like this care about amber? Why is there so many of it? Why are the why are there still boxes here? You think they would have rotted away by now? Even in a toxic environment like this, I mean, microbial life is stubborn stuff. Can we not push this into this big rectangular pit? Nope. We cannot. It sounds like something's trying to shoot us though. Oh no, it's a oh. Well, never mind. Nice try, robot. What? This goes to show you should you should be careful. There's certainly something shooting them. I'll always let the dust clear before you take a step forward. Is that that's the sort of recklessness Vice warns near again. Wow, this room just keeps going, doesn't it? I hadn't realized how far back I was. What was that for, Emil? Let the dust clear. See, if Nier just charged forward there, Nier would be dead. Yeah, this really does sound like something's shooting at us, though. Where is it? Is it that robot that fell into the vent? I'm mean, amazed it's still functioning, if so. Yeah, look down there. It looks like there's some molten metal or something. Oh, wait, no, it's in here. Yeah, it's in here. Where is it, though? Specifically? Anywhere? I mean, surely it's somewhere. I mean, let's be honest here. Probably in here. Here we go. Now, this is a suitably big room. You know what's going to be in here in a moment? Hordes of monsters. Or robots instead of monsters in this case. Same difference, though. Robots are just the kind of monster. If this were, you know, if we were creating a bestiary, it would include robots as well as more proper monsters, like Shades. The great thing about that spell is it takes out robots whose positions you're not even aware of. Yeah, you know, if Nier were to decide to go after humans, he would be unstoppable, you know? That would be really bad news for humans. But Nier would never do anything like that, because like I said, all human life is safe, and he appreciates that. Well, perfect. You know, more or less. It's more or less perfect. It's pretty perfect, all things considered. In fact, you know what I think it's time Nier does? Another one! Just so. I gotta keep in mind that I can... Oh! I much prefer the ones that shoot magic pellets to the ones that use electricity. Because I can harvest magic from, you know, the electric, the magic pellets, but not so much from the electricity. Uh, yeah, you know what, Vice? As much as I like Dark Phantasm, right now I think Dark Lance would be more helpful. That's what we're gonna uh, switch to. While we're at it, though, let's see, um, better do this. What is Conestra? 
Wow! Magic and knockback resistance are both raised by 15%. But from their base value, what were they before? Uh, I'm not sure. Oh well, whatever, who cares. Uh, while we're here though, I should probably also do that to my magic. Oh. Nothing new with this. Well, no, there was some change there. I really also change this one. Yep. I know we're just upping item drop rates, but I consider that a worthwhile, you know, enterprise. What? Whoa! Wait, is that that... That's that robot from all those years ago! Okay, so yeah, I was just saying it wasn't hostile. This is clearly hostile now. This is a much more humanoid robot. Asimov explained that although uh, we could have built them much more lifelike, we didn't to avoid invoking the uncanny valley. Still though, his robots were not built for combat, they were built for more like domestic purposes. Would you quit doing that? I don't appreciate that giant robot man. On the contrary, but I understand that's what it was built for. Look at those electrical things on its shoes. What? Oh, is that what this is? We have to go through all that trouble for one memory alloy? Didn't we need like 10 of them? Criminy. Oh, there's the thing that was shooting magic pellets at us. And now it dispenses a bomb for some inexplicable reason. Or not. Never mind. Wait, hold on. Did it? Yeah, it did. What's up with that? Beats me. Okay, kind of move this time. Thank you. Oh! Anybody get hit by shrapnel? And, you know, Kaine says something about how shrapnel, like, isn't really a... You know, she doesn't worry about shrapnel. Some joke about how, you know, I'm, t like I'm, I'm tougher in steel or something. She wouldn't really say anything like that. She doesn't have much of a... Well, she has a sense of humor, obviously, but it's mostly derived from being mean to people. All right, we're just going to cut back. So we don't have to go through the steam hole room. I sympathize with that. Okay, Emil, Kaine, this is dangerous what Nier is doing here, you know. That you guys wouldn't understand. Well, who am I kidding? We all eat danger for breakfast. Uh, well, I guess we're just gonna be on our way then. Nice place here. Not a single functioning robot left. Nothing quite like wandering over the spoils of your battles, huh? It sure would be nicer though if we could actually see the heaps of scrap. Because for every one of these robots they destroy, they're only taking a small number of parts from it. Like maybe just one. Or two, you know, the broken antenna or whatever. Or, but, oh. Do I really want to do this? Hold on. Hold on here. How many? I have six of these, six of the... E that's enough. I'll, I'll dare. You guys going to get in? No, well, I mean, you don't need to get in, Emil. You're already floating along. Come to think of it. Probably equip a more powerful weapon. I mean, oh wait. Uh, whatever, I'll just go with this one. I like this one. I can swing it fast. What other sword can you swing that many times in one second, huh? Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. Yeah, we can't turn far enough to hit that one anymore. Well, I'm just gonna have to wait until my magic gets, uh... Wait, how's Kine? Oh, Kine's just gonna teleport over after all this is done. And then, you know, cute, it'll, 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 it's the wacky ending of the sitcom. Roll credits. You know, like, doom 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 do, you know, play a little theme. Play a jazzy credits theme. Which is a jazz, the credit theme is the jazzy version of the main theme, I mean. Hey, 
Camille, could you take out these cannons? I know that you have it in you, kid. I mean, I know you have it in you. You know, kind of, you know, if he was apparently designed as a weapon, I, I'm aware. But, like, I'd say that he is at least... I mean, Nier is as dangerous as he is. And Nier is just... Well, like I said, Nier is no ordinary guy, but it wasn't like he was built by, by you know, scientists to use as a weapon. By, or rather, by scientists in the unethical employ of the military-industrial complex. Or who knows, maybe they're not so bad. Maybe they're just like, well, maybe they're like Dr. Andonuts, and they're only doing it because they're being forced to. Or maybe it's like they're the scientists who just have some great passion for, you know, for their research, but the only way they can get funding is by turning to the military. And so in addition to doing the research they want to do, they have to build weapons. It's all very tragic. It's a good thing they're shooting all these magic pellets, actually, or it would be much harder to keep having enough, enough magic to destroy them with. Like this one right here. There we go. You see, normally, you aim with the right analog stick, which you also use to control the camera. But in that minecart bit, you aim, like, you aim using the, um, the left stick, which you normally use to move, which is why I was confused for a moment. I don't know what that was for, kid. Oh, come this far. Wait, no. We can't- oh, hold on. This way. Wait. This way. Of course, Kaine's already here. Of course. So you open this door and it turns out it was just back to where we started. And Kaine says, oh, you know, I just took the door. It seems we have been shut in. Oh, another one of these, huh? Well, I took one out. I can take out another. I almost feel sorry for this thing with all the dark lances that are going to stab through it. Not quite. I appreciate what you did to Kaine there, but she does have amazing healing powers because she's a shade. See, there they are going into effect. Oh! Oh, even more. I see. They just keep on coming. Even when they work, they can spark so much that it's hard to tell if they have been blown. You know, it's hard to tell they haven't been destroyed yet. Well, sometimes. Probably because they're just shooting out electricity as their main means of attacking, you know. Maybe we went too deep. I think we went too deep, guys. Wait a minute. Oh darn, I went the wrong way. Don't tell me they're all gonna be back. Okay, the big one isn't back. I can deal with these normal small fry.
I'll just be quiet for a moment. Let us appreciate the concert of destruction. Down here, you're not going to find any healing herbs. It's certainly the main issue, actually. I mean, yeah. Well, before we go down, I'm kind of curious what's up. Oh, nothing is up. What's up, Dak? Well, it looks like there's something in here, at least, other than a dead end. I mean, it's kind of curious. Oh, here we go. There. Hey, Vice. Remember we were earlier using Dark Phantasm? It is my belief that that would be good again now, so we're gonna use again. You ready, Vice? You ready? You ready? You ready, Vice? Vice was ready. Broken batteries be very dangerous to handle. Like, aren't they toxic? Well, who am I kidding? Very dangerous is obviously no concern to these guys. Oh, we got some of that machine oil. We needed that for something or other, didn't we? It's always the rare things that people want. Probably why they can't just go buy them themselves, really, because they're, you know, rare. Well, before we go down there, I guess we probably should see some of the other rooms around here, right? Right. Absolutely, as a wise man once said. You think this was built by the same organization that's responsible for creating a meal? Because you'd think that either you'd be focusing on the development of living weapons or on these kinds. Not on both. You know, I saw that you just hit a Kaine there. I don't appreciate it when people hit her. Oh, look at all of these guys! So many! Oh, they're all dead now. I know that a lot of the time Nier just sort of vainly hits walls with his sword. That sure, but you know, you can't, can't argue with his track record though. It's pretty impressive. So of course Kaine can heal because she's a shade, and Emil can heal because, well, I mean, he doesn't even have any skin to hurt. What about these other guys? Like, I mean, near, I mean, like, what does he, how does he heal like this? Don't, you're not going to tell me medicinal herb can make up for the amount of blood he loses. Are you? Yeah, nothing. Just raw materials, all that fills these lower rooms, isn't it? Eh, I'll keep looking just to be sure. Well, we're gonna need one of those, a bomb to throw at those. But we're not gonna get one. Nope. Not gonna get one. No, oh, um, oh wait, maybe down here? Yeah, here we go. Yeah? We've been shut in, and... Is there, is there even any robots in here? What's going on? Oh, we're shut in one way. Well, that's not good, is it? Maybe I shouldn't have destroyed those. They're probably gonna would have been good cover for when something begins shooting. But all right, fine. So we've been shut in lots of times. Oh, fine. Do you really insist? Oh, you're still standing after that. I didn't... Um, go figure. You know what?
at a certain point, you know, you just gotta face the fa wait, blade of- that's what it looks like? It's called a blade of treachery and it looks that, I don't know, noble? Absurd. Yeah, we didn't get any bombs, so that was a total waste of time then. Well, not totally. I mean, we got some more scrap. Oh! Here we go. Never mind, we're gonna hit some bombs after all. Two-handed swords might be good for fighting armored shades, but not so much for what we're dealing with now. This factory just produces an endless number of these things. They call it this the junk heap, but this is not a junk heap. Look at this place. This is a working factory, even after all these hundreds of years. Yeah, that's not gonna get us through. Oh, it would've got us through that one, maybe. Well, I mean, it's worth a try, I guess. Okay, Kaine, I know that you love getting in the way, I don't have a second to spare with this one, so okay, don't get in the way or near- Is dead! Oh, okay. Okay, you know what? Forget it. Sometimes it's not worth dying. It's not worth dying. Let's just freaking see what's over here, shall we? Better be something good. Like a, another elevator. I really need to get back to the surface and get some more healing items. But I know better than to expect anything good. Let's be honest here. Oh, Yona. Always on Nier's mind, every day these last five years. Oh, yeah, we're about to meet something big. Oh, or not. I mean, this is obviously some kind of, like, you know, manufacturing complex. Uh, I think it's good to switch back to Dark Lance. Yeah. This is me crazy. This strikes me as the best thing against these airborne opponents. Broken batteries, better than nothing. So sometimes, I don't know, you gotta pick your fights. Now, not with Shades. With Shades, you need to kill all of them. With these things, eh, not worth the time. Well, this one walked right up to us, practically begging to be blown up. I bet you were gonna get to the heart of this factory, and it turns out it's being run by shades, right? Of course. Of course that's what's going on. Wait, an elevator! Okay, thank god there is a way back up. Still, we didn't get any of the... Well, we got a few of the parts we need, but not nearly enough. We'll have to run around for hours in here, won't we? Wait, what the... Oh... Oh! That was very close. That was almost the end of our journey right there. What? Emil, what's going on? Oh, did he just heal us? Is that what he's doing when he does that? It might be. If so, thanks, Emil. I really do appreciate it. Uh, actually, before I do this, maybe I should switch to a better weapon. Uh, yeah, I'll stick with these Bane. If I optimized it, yeah, I have. Wait, I should not have done that. Damn. Well, I guess I'll have to get through this no matter what heal health items I have available to me. Wait, what? Huh? I can't get down the door. Do we actually have to go down in this hole? That couldn't be. Well, why don't we find out? Near, I'm amazed that didn't kill you. Wait, what's this? Weapon test. Wait, Dad, this is where we took down that giant robot before, isn't it? 
think it is. Is it? Might be. Yeah, I think this is. We'll be able to just get down this deep again if we want by going to that elevator on the surface. I'm gonna go with yes. Hey. Thanks. Wow, really? Wait, how did I help? Like, is it all those years ago when I helped you out? Well, then why would you ever charge? Anyway, thanks. Well, actually, this is gonna take a little more time than I thought. No sense in you waiting around. I'll send you a letter once it's ready. That would be great. So I did get enough stuff after all. I guess it was just my mistake thinking I didn't. Hmm, it seems we have some free time on our hands. Forest of Myth. Popla said we might be able to find something in the Forest of Myth. He will forgive me if I seem less than enthusiastic about such a trip. Yeah. It wasn't that bad, you know? It's not like they'll have the same problem there again. Well, I guess I was a little better off than I thought. Let's go still break some robots, though. Well, actually, no, we shouldn't. We need to get... I need healing items. I'll travel back to... back to the village. Buy some herbs from that guy who's just begging us to buy from him now. Might as well just be begging full stop if he's gonna plead as much as he does. Oh, I'm sorry, that's mean. All human life is sacred. Nier understands that. It's interesting. It feels like any time any one of the team has a sort of moral oversight, another one of them is able to correct that. Is able to point it out to them, to bring it to their attention. And I really do uh, respect that. Really, there's so much stuff we need to get out of the scrap heap, and it takes so long to get up here because we have to climb the scaffolding every darn time. Guess that's just life for you, isn't it? Actually, we might not have to buy any kind of, uh... Yeah, you know, we might be able to get away with just not buying any medicinal herbs from town. Yeah, you know. Okay, back to the scrap, to, to the... I keep calling it the scrap heap. The junk heap. You know, full of junk. Junk, junk, junk! Man, being a scavenger has its perks. Though I still don't know who keeps putting those there. I mean, Nier is really stealing those herbs, isn't he? Makes me feel kind of bad. Ah, oh, well, not that bad, though. Kaine, Emil, come on, my misfits. Don't get me wrong, Nier's kind of a misfit, too, but... Only kind of. Yeah, there are so many medicinal herbs around here. It's almost like they're regenerating through magic. Go figure. Anyway, I know, we're gonna go check on the Forest of Myth. It's still strange that even after all the time we spent in here, we didn't find any piece of this seal. Now, it's possible that at this point someone has removed it. I mean, how long must it have been since it was in here, right? You'd think something like this would once again be using some kind of Guns? I mean, I'm glad it's not. You know, we would already be dead if it had guns. But it just is surprising as all. Not that its current weapons are ineffective exactly, but they don't strike me as being the most in line with modern military needs. Of course, who knows what's going to happen if they um, uh, begin, say, developing, well, shades or whatever. But, uh... Alright. 
You guys? Nice knowing you guys. I'm being joked. I'm, 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 you know, I'm being facetious, of course. It's, it really wasn't nice knowing you. We just follow the principle of break enough of them and you find valuable stuff eventually, right? Right. On the subject of that vice, how is the getting valuable stuff thing going? Yeah, we don't have nearly enough things for the lighthouse. What about, um... Let's see... This one. Is this the one? Yeah, so we need to get those seeds. I have no idea where that would be. Oh yeah, this one. We have enough eggplants, enough goat hides, but we still need more sh machine oil. And we have to bring that to him before he'll be willing to, uh, give us the parts for the wheel back in town. Hi. How you doing this evening? Not the best, I guess. You know, it's funny, that weather outside, huh? I mean, look at the size of this room. How far down does that go? This facility must go miles into the mountain. I hate to imagine if what would ha how I'd feel if that kid died because we took too long, you know? Imagine that weighing on Nier's conscience. And Nier is a man who, who can't stand the idea of any kind of injustice, particularly against families. He's a family man, in a kind of weird, violent, gory way. Which is, once again, goes against typical video game protagonist expectations. Although then again, Pac-Man is a pretty famous uh, video game protagonist, and in most of his incarnations, he's portrayed as a family man. Perhaps surprisingly. Most of them. Recent years, Namco seems to have decided that they hate Pac-Man and don't want him to be in anything good. Hopefully by the time this video is uploaded, though, that'll be proved wrong. You'll hear that and you'll think, oh, actually, no, there's this great new game about Pac-Man. But <laughs> that'll never happen. Let's be honest here. Oh, I hear some shades. I almost wonder how many how many episodes of shade killing should really be included in the final uh, in the final version of the video. Ah well, I think we can at least include include this one, right? Yeah, I think so, too. Okay. Um... I like the look of this one. Yeah, this is better for when they're swarming around you. It's not so good if you just um, need to go after them individually. I realize that I actually can't criticize them on the grounds that, like, oh, you shades are cowards who aren't... Wait a minute. It's another one. I think this is one of the pieces of cargo that washed ashore. I'm not going to look inside. I dare say I can see no reason why the old woman would need this much baggage. That's not for us to say. And it could be anything. Maybe it'll turn out she's smuggling cocaine or something. Well, the forest of myth, I suppose. Spoke. This shade has intelligence and emotion. Who cares? <laughs> <laughs>